Hey, what's up guys, my name is Blake, and today we're gonna to be talking about five tips to help you guys actually get fit in 2020. Let's go. So first of all, I'm not like a fitness guru, I'm not a personal trainer, I'm not a physical therapist, I'm not any kind of professional, anything, whatever. Um, I'm just a normal person just like you. I wanted to get um, in shape, I wanted to gain muscle, I wanted to lose fat, I wanted to get fit. So, um, and I have managed to somewhat do that. Um, I used to be just over 200 pounds, now I'm down to like 179. So. Um, lost a lot of fat and retained a lot of muscle and starting to build, mu build a lot more muscle and a lot more strength now. Like I said, just a regular person uh, from me to you, trying to give you five tips to help you get fit this year. So number one is convenience. Convenience has been a big factor into my success from the how I prepare my food, workouts and how long the workouts are, where I work out, all that stuff. Convenience has played a huge factor because if it wasn't convenient, it would be hard to stick to. If it's hard to stick to, then it's hard to keep it going, right? So convenience is number one. Try to do your best to make sure that you are making it easy on yourself, basically, because um, like I said, the harder you make it on yourself, the worse it's gonna be to have to keep sticking to it. Whatever you can do to help yourself um, and take a lot of the guesswork out of things, whether it be do your research on training or buy a training program um, or buy a meal plan or whatever you can do to make it so that it's the most convenient for you. Number two, uh, seeing results. Seeing results is definitely gonna help you, obviously, and obviously you have to start and you have to stick to it, but um, seeing results has definitely been a big motivator for me. Um, even the, the first month that I kept, that, that I stuck to it and I saw the small changes in my appearance, um, in my weight and all that kind of stuff and my definition and all that, those things are gonna help you. So the more results, the, the longer you stick to it, the more results you're gonna see, the more results you see, the more motivated you'll be and you'll just keep going from there. So I know it's hard, it's hard at first to start, it's hard to keep going, it's hard to keep pushing at it when you think you're making no progress, but start taking pictures. Just take before pictures, take a month, one month pictures, take two month pictures, um, even if you wanna take a picture a week, whatever, um, just so that you're keeping track of your results so that you can keep being positive, keep being motivated, and just stick to your goals. I mean, seeing results, I don't just mean in your physical appearance, in your body, whether you're losing fat, getting more definition or whatever, gaining muscle, but in your actual performance. Um, sometimes in my job, I have to be a little bit physical. Um, I work at a package center, so sometimes I actually, sometimes I gotta work a little bit harder than other days, and actually seeing those results um, has helped me a lot, actually feeling them and, and putting those, putting the, putting my strength to the test, essentially and seeing that my performance is actually better as well as my appearance. So seeing results is huge. The third thing that's gonna help you get fit in 2020 is um, your nutrition. Your nutrition, and really your nutrition should have been number one, but um, making sure that you're eating right. You have to eat right. And you don't have to eat perfect. You don't have to eat food that's disgusting, that you don't like, that's flavorless. Um, but you have to eat right. You have to make sure that your diet's in check. You will never outwork a bad diet. I don't care how hard you work out in the gym. I don't care if you work out for two hours every day. You're not going to outwork a bad diet. Um, you know, if you're eating garbage every single day, you're eating high calorie, high fat foods and all that stuff, you're not gonna work that stuff off. You're not gonna see results and all the work that you're doing in the gym is gonna be for nothing because you're not gonna see the results that you want because you're not eating right. So. The, I would say that's probably the number one thing that you have to make sure that you do is make sure your, your diet or your food that you eat is on lock. And the thing that's gonna help you with this too is you need to find foods that you like. Um, and there are plenty of good foods out there that you, that you will probably like, that you will enjoy, that you like eating every day. I mean, my biggest problem for me personally was I ate way too much fast food. I ate out every single day. Um, I ate McDonald's every day, Taco Bell, all that stuff, all the, all the nasty stuff. And so for me, just changing my diet alone was huge um, and helping me lower my body fat percentages and all that stuff. Just do your research online. There's a lot of meal plans out there that you can, that you can either buy or um, there's a lot of research you can do on good foods. Plenty of blogs and stuff out there that can tell you good stuff to eat. The thing that has helped me the most with my nutrition is the workout program that I bought. I bought um, the Athlete X. Um, program from Jeff Cavalier. He's a, he's a physical therapist guy on YouTube that I found. Um, and all of his programs have meal plans in them. So they help you out a lot. They give you 
breakfast, lunch, dinner. They give you snacks. They, it tells you when to take your supplements, all that good stuff. Um, so it takes all the guesswork out of it. So you don't really have to worry about it. I don't, I honestly, I don't stick to all the meals that are in the meal plan. What I did was I picked a few out and then once I got used to making good food that um, I liked, that I enjoyed, that I knew weren't bad for me or you know, calorie wise or whatever, um, I just tweaked things a little bit and made sure that I'm eating meals that I like um, and sticking to the general guidelines of the, purport, the, of the portions and all that good stuff. So yeah, meal plan, I can't stress that enough. If you are bad with this stuff, go out there, buy a meal plan. It's gonna help you a lot. <sighs> All right, so number four is good guidance. Um, and what I mean by this is something or someone to help you stay on track, to give you um, a clear vision of where you wanna be, how to get there. Um, and for me, I knew what I wanted. I didn't know how to get there. I didn't know how long I should work out for, what kind of exercise I should be doing, how many times a week I should be working out, all that stuff, um, just because I don't, I don't know that. So what I did is I bought, like I said, I bought uh, Athlean X, AX1 is I think is what it's called, um, from Jeff, <sighs> excuse me, from uh, Jeff Cavalier, he's on YouTube, you can look him up, Athlean X, he's got a bunch of programs, um, he's very, very good. He's a physical therapist. He's worked with a bunch of Major League Baseball teams. He works with NFL players and a bunch of other people to this day. Um, and he's got a bunch of free content out there that you guys can check out. I'll link his channel below. Um, it's not, this video is not, not sponsored or anything like that, but um, I just really, really, really enjoyed the program. I've gotten huge results from it and I can't vouch for that program enough. And Jeff, Jeff's done a great job with it. But anyway, good guidance. And so Jeff is, the Athlete Next is set up very, very easily. All the workouts are there every single day. They have a calendar for you every single day. You can see what to eat. You can see which workouts you're gonna be doing. It tells you reps, all that stuff. It gives you specifics. All the specifics are there. All the guesswork is gone, basically. So all you literally do, you pay your 95 bucks, you get all your meals, all your meal plans. So obviously you have to go buy the food, but you get the meal plan, you get all the workouts, you do it day by day, and Jeff walks you through every step of the way. So it literally, um, having somebody there to guide you through it the entire time has helped me the most. So I don't have to think about it. I know I'm gonna get good results because the guy's a professional and he knows what he's doing. He's done all the research and all the science behind it and all that stuff. So I trust it, um, and I don't have to think about it. All I gotta do is look at the look at the website. These are the workouts I'm doing today. I gotta do this, you know, this many reps. I gotta do this to failure. I gotta do this many reps of this. I get the workout. Um, good guidance, I can't stress that enough, is very, very important. It takes all the guesswork out. Um, and the last one, number five, is determination, which sounds really corny, really cheesy, but you have to be determined to get the results that you're shooting for. Um, and so I, I know where I wanna be, and I'm just gonna keep pushing until I, until I get there. Um, you, have to, you have to get up every day and you have to want it. Make it a priority. I'm not saying it put, it put it way above everything else. I'm not saying put it in front of your family or nothing like that. But you're gonna have to make it a priority in some way. You're gonna have to make some time for it. Um, if it's, because if it's important to you, you have to get, be determined and be intentional on getting it done every single day. Um, and never ever quit. It will get hard. There's gonna be times where you feel like you're not making any progress, but do not quit. Because as soon as you quit, um, you're gonna feel terrible about yourself and it's gonna be that much harder to get back in the game. Um, and the other thing is, uh, slip ups are going to happen. You're going to have your kid's birthday. You're going to have a piece of cake. You're going to, you know, it's going to be, um, you know, Thanksgiving meal and you're going to eat a crap ton of food. It's going to be Halloween. You're going to eat some of your kid's candy. So slip ups are going to happen. Nobody's perfect, but don't let that stuff phase you. I'm not saying hop off the wagon and you'll go crazy. I'm just saying slip ups are going to happen. Don't worry about it. Don't beat yourself up over it. Just keep pushing through and you're gonna make gains, okay? Um, and the only, the last thing I would say um, as, as, as like a little bonus tip, bonus. I think the biggest thing that has helped me actually meet my fitness goals um, is making this a lifestyle. Um, and Athlean X, Jeff, he talks a lot, a lot about this. You know, when you go on a diet, you call it a diet for a reason because you're on it temporarily, right? And, and I'm, I'm like, I'm quoting this from Jeff Cavalier YouTube. Like I said, go check his channel out. Um, but, if you, but if you make these things a lifestyle change, 
you implement it into your life so that it's not something you're on temporarily. It's something you're gonna be doing every single day. It's a lifestyle choice. It's not a diet, it's a lifestyle choice. That's why when you figure out your meals that you like, it's easier to stick to rather than say, hey, I'm gonna go on the keto diet and I'm gonna stick to this for three months and I hate it the whole time. And I'm, after the three months, I'm gonna be glad it's over. No, lifestyle changes you shift your lifestyle for the better. And all these changes are gonna help you and then you're gonna like it. You're gonna like the food that you eat, so you're gonna stick to it. You're gonna like looking better, you're gonna like feeling better, so you're gonna stick to it. So make sure that you're actually making a lifestyle choice, lifestyle change, not just going on a diet. So hope these things have helped you guys. I know all these things have helped me big time. And um, like I said, I'm not a professional, uh, but I do think that these five tips will help you guys um, to get fit, stay fit, meet your goals in the year 2020. So um, thanks for watching. If you like this content, please like, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. See ya.